Hello, my name is Dr. Joe Shepard from Shepard Chiropractic. Today we're going to talk about auto accidents. We're also going to talk about some of the common factors that I see that increase the likelihood of the severity of your injury, the length of treatment, and the possibility of chronic pain. So here they are, the eight most common factors that I see in my office. Number one is a rear end collision. Research shows that being hit from behind causes more of a severe injury due to the fact that your head is whipped forward and then backward again. Number two, being unaware of the accident. When you're unaware of the accident, you're unable to protect yourself by guarding and protecting your muscles. So there are increase in likelihood of the severity of muscle strain and sprains also. Number three, having your head turned to the left or to the right, just as if you're looking through the, the rear view mirror or the side mirror. And the reason for that is when your head's turned to the left, there's more increase of stress and strain to the muscles of the neck. Number four, females are injured more in car accidents than men. And the reason for that is the muscle structure and density is not as developed. So when they're in an accident, they're going to be more prone to stress, strain, and ligament injury also. Number five, having a pre-existing degenerative condition like arthritis or maybe a, a disc bulge or disc protrusion. When you have those type of pre-existing injuries, your body is more susceptible to have more of a severe injury. Number six is age. If you're a little bit older, you're gonna have a little bit longer healing time than someone who's younger. That's just a part of the process. So you have to be a little bit more patient. It does take longer when you're a little bit older. Number seven is health conditions like asthma, hypertension, osteoporosis, cancer, or maybe diabetes. These health conditions will slow your healing process and it will take a little bit of time. So just be patient. And the final one, number eight, is the speed of the vehicle. The faster you are going or the faster that you're hit is the more severe your injury will be. And the reason for that is your body is stretched further and it's strained more when you're hit from behind or from the front. So injuries do occur at slower speeds, but more severe when you're going faster. I also want you to make sure you wear your seatbelt because that does protect you in many ways for more of a severe injury. I want to thank you for listening. Dr. Joe.